Hi folks, welcome to this session on number system. So continuing with our uh, uh, sessions on rational and irrational numbers, here I have come up with a table which explains some of the important results of rational and irrational number operation. So what I have done is I have uh, I have made a table where x is one of the uh, rational or irrational numbers. So these are numbers x and y are numbers and we are doing some operation on an x, x and y. Okay, so let us try and understand what exactly this means. So hence if you take a rational number x and add and subtract another rational number the result is always going to be irrational. So this is what you need to know. Example, so 3 by 5 plus 1 is 8 by 5. So what are, what does it mean? So whenever any time you add or subtract a rational from another rational number, you are never going to get an irrational number. You will always get a rational number. Secondly, rational number, second this one, rational number multiplied or divided by rational number. Mind you, division by 0 is not allowed. So hence I have written except 0. So rational number into Rational number and rational number divided by another rational number except 0 always lead to lead to a rational number, right? Examples you can try 2 into 5 is 10 minus 1 into 3 by 2 is minus 3 by 2. You can take some examples for a division as well. You'll always end up with rational number. Third is rational plus minus and irrational so always will be irrational number. You will never get a rational if you add or subtract an irrational number from a rational number. So 0 is a rational plus root 3 which is irrational will give you root 3 here and root 3 plus 2 is a sum of rational and irrational which is an irrational number. Next, rational number multiplied or divided by irrational number. Again, we are not, so rational number which we are taking should not be 0 here because 0 into anything will lead to 0. So hence, except 0 if you have a rational number and an irrational number, if you multiply and divide, you will always get an irrational number right so hence rational number when multiplied by irrational number or divided by rational irrational number will be an irrational number now most interestingly irrational plus minus irrational is not necessary a irrational it may be rational or it may be irrational as well okay so example examples are here if you see uh, root 3 minus root 3 is 0 which is a rational number now root 3 was a was a um, irrational number when subtracted or added to minus root 3 you will get 0 similarly 2 minus root 3 plus 2 plus root 3 these are two irrational numbers if you sum them up you will get 4 which is a rational number right Going forth, irrational multiplied divided by another irrational need not be a irrational number. It may be a rational also. So you can see root 3 divided by 2 root 3 will be 1 by 2, which is a rational number. So hence, in case of multiplication and division, irrational uh, multiplied or divided by irrational number may lead to a rational or irrational number. So you keep these uh, results in mind and you might be uh, interested in proving them and uh, in the subsequent sessions we'll see how to prove such results thank you